Good luck to all punters, owners and trainers. Ready? And racing into stepping out best out wide was Sharina Hill along there with Pistol Princess showing up and coming around the outside now as Bright on Time goes to second. Just in behind another Pearl Jericho Storms finding trouble. The inside to Dark Garner. They've got away on Eva Storm and also MCD. They go for home. The inside's Bright on Time. The outside Pistol Princess giving plenty and also rushing home Dark Garner right along the inside and over the top another Pearl. Oh, this is close. Dark Garner, another Pearl was flying on the outside. Pistols Princess was still there and is still there on the inside of that. Well, just, well, that was Sharina Hill. Gee, this is a great finish. Then on crossing, Derrico Storm was closing off well. And not too far away there on crossing there up there. It was also a Sprite on time. And the other one, Eva Storm, was just in behind that. Racing off the inside here, super zip zip jump well, but here comes Smash Go around the outside, just in behind Red Mover Hoover, also making ground right round the outside. Spring Majors coming into it very quickly, plenty of times also looking to come off the back of the field. Then we go back to Curious Live and Alamo and Duke, they go for home. Spring Major took over, cut away three or four here on Smash Allegro, late there, Red Mover Hoover, but Spring Major home from Smash Allegro. Then we go to Red Mover Hoover, plenty of time. Then on crossing to Super Zip Zip, and they got away on the other couple there. They were Curious Life and Alamo. Main Duke. and flying out there. Stella Force is going to put a couple on New Thing and now looking to come around the outside as Manu Rama and Purely clearly gets to second. Looking for Racing Rumors Impersonator getting up on the inside there is Winfield Winter. Out wide we go to Wally Baxter and back in the field to Dole Pass. They go for home. Stella Force is going to turn further. Out wide Purely is trying hard and also getting home will New Thing Impersonator but Stella Force has pinched it and Stella Force gets it. Gee, what a line up for second. Oh, impersonators there, Pure Lee's right there, and also not too far away on the inside, New Thing was also poking up, great finish. Uh, then we go back here on crossing and a blanket finish, Manu Rama wasn't uh, too far away, Ollie Baxter, and also just that back and behind them two uh, dull parts, and Winfield Winter just up ahead of that. Racing into out wide here, getting out well with Shock Dio's looking to loop the man, does go straight to the front now from home, which bounce found trouble going ahead of it, Fair Marina, back here we go to Flying Baker, couple back to Lagoon Mac, they've got right away now, I know Power J and Skinny Ankles has got back there with making time, they run for home, in front Shock Dio's from there, Fair Marina now getting home well as Homebush bounce, but away goes Shock Dio's gets here from Homebush bounce, Flying Blake got to third, uh, then on crossing here, uh, close for fourth, Fair Marina was knocking up there with Lagoon Mac getting home well, and they got pretty much a right away on the rest of the field. Opawa Jay making time and skinny ankles did not get into it at all. Set to go, ready. 
And racing into off the inside here. Big Boy Dino along with Corborn Butts. He jumped well while Ego Master found trouble. And around the outside goes Willie Good and says thanks very much. He's put about six or seven lengths on Corborn Butsy. Big Boy Dino. Then we go to Blue and Curly. Back in the field now is Enhancer. And Ego Master found trouble. And individual Lily, but away goes Willie Good. Missed all the trouble and shot away easily to win by about six, seven lengths there to a Corborn Butsy. Then we go there to Big Boy Dino. And at the three, Blue and Curly, Craig Roberts got that to a prediction right. Then we go back here to Allegro Master Enhancer. Was also back there, and of course, Allegro Master just finding trouble there, trying to get across. And at the seven, really good. Has just shot across the field. Set to go, ready. And racing into off centre track here is MBD, but there goes Zuli Mercedes showing up. And now Willie Chili looking for racing room, trying to get around the outside and even, even wider here to not bad. Also trying to cross. Lovely road front for Homebush Dawn, got a good run through. Back in the field to Smoking Marley. MBD's got a bit of a shuffle here with Powerhouse Lee. They go for home. Willie Chili took over in front, got to the lead. Late run down the outside, not bad, but Willie Chili will get this. I think not bad. Has just got that second there uh, from Homebush Dawn's gone a very good race. And also close up there we had. Fastback King and Smoking Marley's gone a good race once again. Zulu Mercedes was also back and also back in the cross on crossing there. Uh, if we didn't call it, was a fast, uh, not Fastback King, the other one there. Smoking Marley, the Southern, it was about midfield. Powerhouse Lee, the other one I'm looking for there, was just in that uh, back group as well. Ready. And racing into off the inside. Nickers entry jump well along there with Bundor and Lassa now trying to scout round the outside as Botany Liz. Even wide on the track to Peaky Blinder. Corborn Gable between runners. Back we go to Wymac Dave. Got a shuffle there with Kerry Yuck Lane. Also Homebush Button and Bundor and Lass. They go for home. Inside Botany Liz has got to the lead out wide. Nickers entry trying hard. Botany Liz will get this from Nickers entry. Then we go to Corborn Gable. Kerry Lane. Not too far away there on crossing. Uh, we would have had Wymac Dave. Uh, just up ahead of that was a Peaky Keep blinder back to Homebush Button and Bundor and Lass. Set to go, ready. And racing into mid track here. Don't muzzle me straight to the front from working jill going up to head it off and trying to get around the outside is Homebush Melvin. The inside to opportunist joined there by Vinnie Baxter. A couple back here to Gummy Gumstar. Back in the field now with Bundor and Ladd and also a Corborn legs. They race for home. Don't muzzle me. The outside working jill giving plenty. Vinnie Baxter's also rattling home on the inside. Out wide working jill. Working jill will get this okay. I think don't muzzle me has just done enough to hold on second from Vinnie Baxter. And they were queuing up for third as well. We had Homebush Melvin. Bundor and Lab was rattling home. Opportunist wasn't too far away. Corborn legs up with that group as well. First leg of the quaddy, ready. 
And racing, Corborn Bright Jump very well is going to go straight to the front and now looking to squeeze up on the inside there is Sweet Ruby Jane but found a bit of trouble, now gets through out wide here we go to Corborn Miami getting up underneath him is Extreme Twist back here we go to Zipping Rory also back in the field to Flying Twist and to Botany Ritchie they charge down the back and Corborn Bright away by four or five, trying to come out after it now is Extreme Twist, two or three back here we go to Corborn Miami not far away, Zipping Rory getting away there on Flying Twist, back in the field to Botany Ritchie and Sweet Ruby Jane won't be in it, they go for home, Corborn Bright travelling okay Extreme Twist is going a good race on the outside, Corborn Bright is going to have to kick hard and she will, she'll get there from Extreme Twist, then we go to Corborn Miami a nice run, zipping Rory back in the field here to Sweet Ruby Jane just didn't really get all favours going into that first corner, Flying Twist and Botany Ritchie All up there, ready. And racing into Timari style, jumped out well there along there with the thrilling Toby. Now trying to come around the outside is Goldstone, tracking into the races out of May and Jar, not too far away now. Spirit Run gets in the clear, but copped a check and went right back and is taken back with it. Uh, there, Timari style, Wall Age has also got affected there, and Dogger Dan back in the last two or three, they go for home. Alame and Jar got up underneath thrilling Toby, out right, right back in the field here to Big Wonder, up they come. Alame and Jar will get this okay from thrilling Toby. Bit of trouble here, big wonder to third. Spirit Run got going again for fourth. Then we go back to Goldstone, not too bad. Break back to Wall Age and Dogger Dan and a Timari style. Set to go, ready. And racing off the inside, Vegas. Danny jumps, jumps straight to the front and put two or three here on the Brazier de Vries. Coming around the outside is Malachi Magic squeezing up as Siggy Garo goes to third. A couple back to Bruiser Bell. Break back in the field to Opawa Tom. Two or three here to Speed Legends. Got plenty to do along there with memory laps. They run to the corner. Vegas. Danny's going to turn first. Centre track now. Brazier de Vries is trying to come out after it. Even wider here to Malachi Magic though. But Vegas Danny, three out of three from box one, gets here from Brazier de Vries. Then we go here to Siggy Garo. Malachi Magic. Jack. Then on crossing here to Opawa Tom, back and behind them, Bruiser Bale, and towards the back of the field, Speed Legion didn't get into it, and nor did Memory Lapse. Play six, ready. And there they go, and out wide here, jumping well there is Thal Romeo along there with Corborn Maddie and trying to get through them now as Boris goes through to third. Tracking around the outside is Corborn Brick, but found a bit of trouble squeezing up Premier Division as he bails off the track. Back on the rail now, we've got Graduation squeezing through along there with Ritzer Danny, and now Corborn Brick goes to the back. They run to the corner. Corborn Maddie's going to turn first. Two or three in front, Thal Romeo going another big race just in behind Boris, but up they come, Corborn Maddie. Corborn Maddie will get this OK. I think Boris has just grabbed that second there off. Thou Romeo, that's very close. Izzy Bale got going late into fourth. Then we go back here on crossing to uh, back there to a Premier Division. And also back in behind Premier Division there, we would have had uh, Ritzer Danny just up ahead of them, graduation. And Corborn Brick was also back there in the last two or three.